including dimensional analysis. Deriving, deriving the formula of any physical quantity. So till now, we people are directly studying the formulas. Yes or no? All of you. For example, if you have taken Newton's second law. What is the Newton's second law of motion? Which all people know. Force is equal to what? Mass into acceleration. Mass into acceleration. That's all. So as we know, force is directly proportional to mass and force is directly proportional to acceleration. That's what we people ask. Is it right or wrong? Speak loudly. Yes, please. Yes, we have to derive that formula F is equal to MA with the help of dimensions. Let us discuss. That is what it is. Our heading. Dimensional analysis deriving the formula of any physical quantity. So if you have taken here, uh, this one will help you deriving the relation between physical quantities using dimensional analysis. So that is you have to remind. So deriving, deriving the relation between physical quantities by using whom guys? Using DA. DA means what? Dimensional, dimensional, analysis. dimensional analysis. So that's all it is. So we'll start now. Question number one. Everybody write it. Force F, force F on a particle, force F on a particle depends on depends upon Roman number one mass m of particle very interesting questions will be now onwards and the questions guarantee questions will be there in neat and jay also so Roman number one and Roman number two acceleration acceleration a of a particle is it okay guys so force F is depends on what? Yes, please. Mass M of a particle, acceleration A of a particle. Now, the question is, find the expression, expression for F. That is what the question. So let's start now. Everybody? Yes, Aswita? Now, so observe very carefully. From the question, we can say, like mathematical spam, they are saying that force is directly proportional to what, guys? Force is directly proportional to? Yes, please. Mass. Mass. Let me take the power if we don't know. The power I'm assuming as a what? The power I'm assuming as a what? X. Same way, force is directly proportional to another thing. What is that, Rudreshwa? Yes, please. Acceleration. So let me take that power I don't know. That power I am taking as a what? Y. Now, both I will combine. As we all know, mathematics, if you want to remove this proportionality, we have to take something. Anybody? Constant. We have to take constant. constant. Yes, constant into m power x, a power y. Anybody having any doubt? Anybody? Please ask. Yes, please. Actually, we know that equation. What is that equation? Newton second law. F is equals to? M into A. M into A. A. M into A. M into A. M power 1. A power. 1. Power. Yes, please. 1. 1. But we don't know correct Laksha. That is what I am assuming as a what? M power X and A power Y. Y. Yeah, that is what. So here, K does not have anything. It is a dimensionless. What is that? Constant it is. So it is dimensionless. Proportionality constant. Proportionality constant. That is what you have to remember. Clear? Now, what is the basic thing for those theory we have studied? Dimensions about. Dimensions of LHS is equals to must be what? Dimensions of? Dimensions of RHS. Dimensions of RHS. So, dimension of LHS is equals to dimension of RHS. If you are solving interestingly, definitely it will be more interesting. 
So fast little me without turning the page. What is the dimensions of LHS force? Dimensions fast. M one L one T four minus two equal to T four minus. Power minus. Very good. Now we don't know the K does not have any dimensions. M M dimensions. M zero L one T four. M dimensions. M means what? Mass. Capital M. Mass. Capital power one. Capital power X. Understand? Rudreshwar. Is it for acceleration dimensions? Acceleration dimension. M zero L power one. Yeah, power L power minus. one, L power one, T power minus two whole power y. Is it right or wrong, Pradosh? Yes, sir. Firstly, Pradosh, just equating Pradosh. Nothing is there. Just we have to equate it. Nothing. Just check it. Now, all of you observe very carefully. M one, M one, and here I will write it like this. Just check it. M one, L power one, T power minus two is equal to this one. M power x. This y is applicable to both. A B whole whole square means can I write as a A square into B square right or wrong? All of you yes, same way. How it will come? Tell me. L power one into y. L, L power y. T power, power minus two y. Power minus two y. Minus two y. Yes or no? Yes, please. So yes, I will compare it now. Check it everybody carefully. M one both the sides are equal. Here M one this side. M one is equals to M power. X. X. M power X. Then base are same. Means powers are what? Powers are equal. So X value is how much? One. 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 Next same way. L compare. Compare L's. L one is equals to L one equal to one. L power Y means means in the sense of what? Y value how much? One. one. Yes, please. Y value. One. Y value one. One. Else. Y value we can find based upon T also. Now t power minus two is equals to t power minus two y. Then what will happen? Minus two is equals to minus two y. So minus minus two cancel. Y value how much, guys? One. 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 That's all. Now substitute in the equation. Then we will get f is equals to k into m yeah. power x a power y, which is equals to k into so k into m power what? M power one a power a one. So actually, this k experimental value. I am not saying my own. Experimentally, that k value is equals to one. Then f is equals to what will become? F is equals to m a. M a. Is it interesting or not? Asmita, is Ali solving? Is Ali? Hello, Asmita. Yes, sir. So that is it's very very interesting actually. So when we are solving, it will be more interesting. When we are, if you are showing interest, definitely it will be very very easy. Now, any doubt in this question, Laksha? No sir. Okay. Next question number two. Can I? Are you completed, brothers? Question number two. You have to try. That's why I am saying. Yes, sir. Yeah. Question number two. So. Just now we have written one formula. Do you remember t is equals to two pi into root of l by g? I have taught you. Yes. Yes, yes. Sir. The same formula we are going to derive, derive now. Right. The time period t of a simple pendulum. Actually, I told you correct that it will come in simple pendulum. Harmonic motion it will come. Okay. The time period t of a t of a simple pendulum. Depends on depends upon Roman number one length of the pendulum length of the pendulum L next Roman number two mass of the bob mass of the bob M so you all people know simple pendulum theory ma theory ada yes please that is what. Next third one, acceleration due to gravity. What is the symbol of acceleration due to gravity? Small g. Small g. Acceleration due to gravity. Nobody will spend minimum uh, like more uh, like hardly thirty minutes, even twenty minutes is more. No one will spend this much time on these concepts because they'll think everything people will understand and they will go. Very fastly, but nothing is understanding and very very important. Surely the numerical one question will come in or any competitive exams. Now find find expression for t. That is what our target. Find expression 
for t very interesting question it's very nice also so you tell me you are saying i will write it you are saying one question is enough for you people you will understand it so what is that time period is directly proportional to length so i don't know power the t power next time is directly proportional to mass so m power y time is directly proportional to acceleration due to gravity so t power i will assume as a what x y and z then combine these three equations remove the proportionality and bring the constant k so what will happen l power x m power y t power g power z what people know k means what before question also you have written it is the time dimension एवरीबॉडी Is equals to RHS dimensions. Firstly, tell me length dimensions. L power x is there. Then m dimensions. M power y. Then acceleration dimensions. L power one. T power minus two. Full power z. Z. Yeah. Now check it here. Here m and l. What is the powers? Ra. I'm just for firstly m and l. M power zero. L power zero. T power. One, one, one is equals to this side. Verify it, everybody. Here, what will come? L power x. L power here. See, just split and write first. L power x. M power y. Yeah. L power one into z. L power z. T power minus z. Which is equals to verify it, everybody. Can I write it as it like this? M power y. L power x plus z. X plus z. Same way. T power. Minus minus two. Yeah, that's all. Now equate it. M power zero equals to M power y. M power zero equals to M power y. Then y value. Y equal to zero. Y equal to zero. Very good. Y equal to zero. Next, L power zero is equals to L power x plus z. Next, so from that I can say x plus z is equals to what? Zero. Zero. So I cannot find it. So let us Zero. go for t value. Sorry. T what is equals to t power what t power minus two z. So one is equals to minus two z. So z value how much am I? Minus one by two. Minus one by two. Minus one by two. Substitute here. You will get the x value. X equal to one by two. As we know, x plus z value minus one by two, which is equals to zero. Then x equals to how much? Ah, brothers. राइट M power zero. Anything anything power zero? What is the value? One. One. Zero. One. One na. One na ma zero ille. One. This one can I write like this? We will verify. This is L power one by two divided by G power one by two. Is it right or wrong, Madhuswa? Yes, sir. Right. K into root of power means one by two means I can write in the form of power. Sorry, root. L by G. L by G. So keep it in mind, all of you. Power one by two means I can modify as a what root root I can write let's say one by two. Now from the experimentally k value how much can you tell me? Experimental value one. two pi. Yeah, experimentally k is equals to two pi. Then what will come formula t is equals to two pi root l by g. two pi root l by g. Is it okay, guys? For those, yes, sir. Yes. So this is what is it interesting or not? So we are having so many things, so many things we have to solve. Of course, we will solve. We have time now. Now for this class, we will study one and only uh, one neat question actually. 
this uh, recent last 2021 uh, neat question actually it is we'll solve the question and we'll wind up the question okay even a uh, question i'll say you after solving the question i will uh, share with you also the neat question need 2021 uh, this question is uh, this question has been asked uh, for four mark i think it is i don't know either two marks or four marks let it be it is so right here if force f you can see that again we are going to find force only if force f write the question if if force f f comma acceleration acceleration what is the draw rudreshwar acceleration a and time t be very smart brothers see that how much you are t r t r chosen chosen as the fundamental physical quantities chosen fundamental chosen chosen fundamental physical quantity fundamental physical quantities find find the dimensions of energy so we have to find the dimensions of energy in the form of what before we have solved before these two questions we have solved this we have to find that now we are deriving the formula actually but before we have derived the dimensions do you remember everybody yes please yes, sir. Yes, sir. same way here so as we all know as we all know energy from means in the sense of what energy is directly proportional to what directly proportional oh. F power, F power, yes please, X. Uh, let me take now, options I will give you, after that you will decide, uh, value is F power 1, A power 1, T power 1, that is B value is, B value is F, A and T power 2, now C value is F, a t power minus 1. Next d value is f a power minus 1 and t power 1. So these are the four options. So we have to derive the energy in the form of what? In the form of what we have to derive energy? In the form of force, in the form of acceleration and as well as in the form of in the form of time. Oh, I will say, you all, we all people know, the first, if you are feeling difficulty, you write all the dimensions of all the quantities. We all people know. First of all, tell me what is the dimensions of energy, everybody? Just let it equating only. Energy dimensions, for those, M power 1, L power 2, T power minus 2. Force dimensions, firstly, M power 1, L power 1, T power minus 2. Acceleration dimensions, L power 1, T power minus 2 same way now time time dimensions what time dimensions time only yes or no guys nobody will answer clear yes so we have to find okay. it now that's all in the form of so dimensional analysis so we start now dimensional analysis everybody yes now so equated brothers what is that so energy is directly proportional to what Ah, what what Laksha B? B is not the ah, B. Oh, Laksha is already found. Laksha already found B Ras is saying. Now you tell me. Very good, Laksha. Correct answer. So dimensional analysis, do it or Deshwar. Tell me, open your mouth. As with the water. Dimensional analysis. So what is the dimensional analysis? E is directly proportional to. Forget about the constants and all. You directly tell me in the form of that. E is directly proportional to F power X. Next, A power. A power Y. Y. Next, T power. T power Z. T power Z. Clear, everybody? Then substitute that. As we all know, E dimensions. What are the dimensions of E? M power 1, L power 2, T power minus 2 oh. equals to F dimensions. Force dimensions. M power 1, L power 1, T power minus T 2. Power minus. X. Same way. A dimensions. Fastly. L power 1, T power oh. minus oh. 2. Why? Same way. Next. Tell me fast. Time dimensions. T power. 
Z. Z. Not two. It is. It is three power Z. Then equate it. That's all you will get it. Then I will split the term. I'll write it. M power one. L power two. T power minus two. This one. Wherever M is coming, check it. M M is not coming anywhere. So I can write M power one into X. What is that? This X is applicable to everything. Mm -hmm. M power X. Clear. Yeah. Next L. L is coming here and L here. Then what will come? L power. Pass everybody. L power X plus X Y. X plus Y. y. Same thing. T power. T here coming, here coming, here coming. T power minus 2x minus 2y plus, plus z. That's all. Understand, Rapados? This is a neat question. Okay? So, m1 is equals to m power x. Then x value how much? 1. One. How much? 1. Next, l2 is equals to l power, uh, sorry, l power 2 is equals to l power x plus y. Then 2 is equals to x plus y. As we all know, x value is 1. Then y value is also what? 2 minus x one. equals to 1. Or 2 minus 1, which is equals to what? y value, everybody. One. y value also 1. Then z value compare. t power minus 2 is equals to t power minus 2x minus 2y plus z. So minus 2 is equals to minus 2x minus 2y plus z. So minus 2 here minus 2 into 1 minus minus 2 into 1 plus z so which is equals to minus 2 minus 2 plus z two. equals to minus 2 2 a minus 2 a sir is it equal to 2 yeah check it everybody minus is 2 minus 2 is equals to minus 4 minus 4 plus z so z is equals to minus 2 plus 4 which is equals to what is the z value two. z value how much guys z value how much Two. Two. So energy Two. is equals to F power X, A power Y, Z, uh, sorry, next what? T power? T power Z. T power Z. So substitute it. F value of the 1. A value one, one. A. T value? T 2. T value 2. So F A T power Two. 2. F A T power 2. So that is what it is. So verify it and tell me what is that? Which option is matching? Sir, B. B. Which option is matching? Yes, please. Option? B. Option B. Aswita, can you able to solve this with Aswita? Different people can solve different way, but you have to solve your own. Do you understand? This is a neat 2021 question. Yeah, you are getting, I think, this is, uh, if I guess is true, this is the four more question. If you have done wrong, one minus. If you are done correct, you will get four more. So till here, let it be. I will stop with this. We will continue. Is any any doubt in this question? Ask me, brothers. Or else we will wind up. Clear? Yeah? Yes, sir. Yeah. Any doubt, Rudreshwa? No, sir. Okay. So that's all. So we will continue from here. So girls also, I think, will understand. We will meet in tomorrow's class. Thank you all. Good night.